When it comes to building a cute outfit, it can be as simple as starting with the classic white button down. Silas Lord Sharkey joins us now to break down a number of ways to leverage the staple piece. And you really can do so much with the absolutely, white button down. Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. So, welcome. Yeah, Thank you. Yes, welcome. Well, thanks well, for having well, me. The lady. first thing we talked about is it's got to be ironed. Yes, that's the hard part, I will say. Iron steam, Donnie wrinkle release is your friend, but you got to keep it crisp. Yeah. Unless it's linen. Linen, we can get away with a little bit of a wrinkly top. So if it's cotton, you got to crisp it up. Okay. 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 What is it really that versatile that you can wear it like to something fancier? Yes. Okay. So let me tell you, this is the one piece in your closet that can take you from work to weekend to running errands to even momming. What I love about it is we can wear it buttoned up as one. Mm -hmm. We can also open it up and just wear it as like a little shirt jacket over a graphic tee. Okay. So we can really take it through a variety of events and we can do white. Uh, that's my favorite, but mm -hmm. there's a variety of color options right now, pinstripe as well, but classic white can't be beat. Mm -hmm. All right. Okay. So you brought some um, examples I to did. show us. All I right. Did. So we're going to start off with the classic way of wearing it. Yes, so this is Bella. We have her in a little bit of a Princess Diana style look here. So we have the oversized option. Okay. We have a nice ribbed biker short. We have it dressed down with sneakers. I don't know if you ladies are familiar with Solomon's. That is the sneaker of the year. Oh, so okay. keep your eye out for those. Okay. We have a nice gold chain around the neck and then we have a beautiful pop of color with a long champ crossbody here. Okay, so Wait, this is out for running errands and stuff. Yes, this okay. is a great weekend take. Why is this Princess Diana? So Princess Diana back in the 80s used to wear those oversized mm -hmm. tops and sweatshirts, graphic sweatshirts with biker shorts. Oh. Everybody's loving it these days. So okay. in an O to that, we're playing into that here. Okay. Uh, oh, that's okay. cute. All, All right. right. Thank you. Nice. That was like the princess never came out. <laughs> <laughs> and maybe for going to boys' soccer games right. or something okay. like right. that. Right. There you go. <laughs> Next, we have Jen. Jen is with us from Maxine's in Elmhurst, a local boutique. So we have her styled in the pieces from her store. Okay. So we have the button down as a base here with a beautiful cotton poplin dress over top. Mm -hmm. So this really helps her take this summer dress into more of this like colder spring season. Mm -hmm. We have bold silver jewelry. She has a stunning bracelet there and watch and stunning silver earrings. And then don't miss the shoes. We have a fun mesh Jeffrey Campbell flat with those fun so, diamond details there. Okay. okay, so let me ask you, how do you keep the shirt from bunching up underneath the, the dress like this? Let me give like you this. a trick. Okay. Spanx. Tuck, tuck it in, your tuck it right on in. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> like, yeah. yeah. Turk and turk into a bodysuit on the Yeah, yeah. Exactly. That'll, That'll keep it nice about. and tight. Okay. Yeah. You got okay. it. All right. You got so it. this is if you want to take it up a little bit. Yes. It's very Hamptons-esque. Exactly. This okay. is our coastal take here. We have the nautical sweater. We have it opened up just over like a, a Target or an Old Navy tank. We can keep it simple. We have a denim on bottom. Those are Levi's. I'm a big Levi's fan. And if you notice at the belt, we have this pop of animal print. We're seeing okay. a lot of animal print this summer. This is just a little J. Crew belt. We have a Target flip flop and then the iconic coastal bag, which is the L.L. Bean boat tote mm -hmm. there. Okay. Oh, All that's right. really cute. That's very cute. And, and white uh, button downs can be different from manufacturer to manufacturer. Yes, absolutely. So I have everybody in the same one today, actually, myself included. We're all in a J. Crew. Oh. It's a really great price point to start with. Okay. But a Gap, a J. Crew, an Old Navy, all of those have really good fits. You can do oversized or fitted as well. Okay. Oh, okay. Absolutely. I like that. Yes, yes. This is great. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. So this is your professional take. Okay. So this is Pam. Pam is a local real estate agent. So we wanted to make sure that she was in a professional look. Mm -hmm. Starting from bottom top here, we have a kitten heel with a pointed toe. We know a pointed toe elongates the leg, so mm -hmm. we love that for Pam. Speaking of Spanx, we have a Spanx pant here. Uh, Their ooh. trousers are amazing, ladies. Yeah, it I have definitely a pair too. definitely shapes the thighs, <laughs> yeah. okay? We have the button down as the base, and then we have a belted blazer. Let me tell you about this blazer, though. It came with a, with a tab on it, so we could tie it with that. But we wanted to elevate it, so we ditched that. We added a beautiful black patent belt she had in her closet. Instantly mm -hmm. elevates the look. Yeah, it gives you a waist, okay. too. Absolutely. And then we got to make sure we pop that collar, right? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We can pop that collar. Okay, <laughs> so and fun. that makes it so cute. Really cute. Okay. okay. Great, right, thank you. And we have one last look here. Absolutely. So this is Nat. Nat comes to us from Glen Allen at Blonde Boutique. So she's in items from her store. This is a classic Americana take on the button mm -hmm. down right. So we have a light wash denim. We have some fun accessories here. We're playing with pops of red at the belt, a very cute woven denim bag. We have pearls at the ears. All three of those pieces are on trend for this summer. And then we have the clear shoe. I love that. Thank and those you. those look cute straight leg jeans too. Yes. Well, let me ask you, at one point, um, 
ladies were wearing the, the shirt tucked in the front, hanging out the oh, back. Yes, yes. So yes. One part in, one out. Often it's called the French tuck. Yeah. I like to just call it a handful tuck because you literally just take a, sh a handful and shove it in. And okay. is that still in? Because I was doing that. Yes, yes. <laughs> okay, I love a tuck. I mean, like we were talking the waistline. Yeah. Anytime I can show the waist, I do it. Yes. So I am very open to tucking things in. And yes. real quickly, what's the difference between the fitted white and just a regular white button down? Does it give you a different look or what? Yeah, so let me tell you, I think when it's fitted, it's a little bit more professional, a little more polished and classic. The oversize is a little bit more effortlessly street style chic. So pending on the event you're going to, you can go fitted or slightly oversized. Do you have a fitted shirt that you like, like a brand that you kind of is your go-to? J. Crew. Oh, it's J. Crew. You, they okay. have a really good J. They have okay. a really good oversized and a really good fitted. Because sometimes that's hard. Your proportions aren't right. I know. Aren't right. I know. And to sometimes pull. you can even do a little cropped if you have a high waist. You can do a cropped, and then you don't have to worry about the tuck at all, right? It uh, just hangs right there. That's really good. All right. Great Styled ideas. by LaurenSharkey.com. You can see more tips and tri tricks from Lauren. Thank you so much. This Thank is great. You. Absolutely. Thank yes. you, ladies. Probably ladies, all in your closets. Great. Yes. Yes. Fantastic. Absolutely.